Hey guys, I'm here with our first thought for the day. And today's section in the UCB Bible Notes is titled, Do the Right Thing. And it looks at the story of Joseph. Now, the story of Joseph is an incredibly powerful story. And if you've not read it before, I would suggest you go away and read it. It's in Genesis 37 all the way to Genesis 47. And you can see from that that the Bible spends quite a long time on the story of Joseph. And I think that's just because in that one story, there is so much you can learn from it. But in today's section, it looks at Joseph doing the right thing. And there are many moments in this story where Joseph does the right thing. There are moments also when he doesn't do the right thing. But we're going to focus on those moments where Joseph makes the right decisions. Um, one of the first ones is when Potiphar's wife tries to seduce him, Joseph knows this is the wrong thing and he doesn't go along with it. He says no and he faces the consequences of saying no and rejecting Potiphar's wife. And then later on in the story, Joseph, who has been treated really badly by his brothers, and that's an understatement how badly he was treated but um when they come back and they're in dire need of food um joseph could have been totally resentful he could have said yeah no you did this to me i'm not going to help you but he doesn't he shows them mercy um and he gives them food and water and he forgives them and i think that's the key thing is he forgives them for what they did he didn't have to it wasn't an easy decision. It was definitely the right decision, but definitely not an easy decision. And doing the right thing isn't always going to be an easy decision. It can sometimes mean going against what all of your friends are doing and not following along with the crowd and doing what everyone else does. It can look like having to hold back your emotions and really trying to think your thoughts through before you say or do anything when someone is annoying you or frustrating you. It can look very simply like actually doing what your parents ask you when they ask and not thinking of excuses and reasons why you can't do it. And um, there is so much that can be learned through that and it's not always an easy thing to do and because of that in that we need to turn to God and ask him to help us. Um, so the challenge that the UCB note set is each morning for the rest of the week um, just going to God and ask him to help you do the right thing and I know in my life that um, when I ask God to help me with things they become a lot easier to do so when I ask him to help me make the right decisions it's still not always easy but it's definitely easier and so maybe this week, why don't you spend some time with God asking him to help you do the right thing, to help you make those decisions that maybe you find difficult to make, but you know that you want to make. And just see what spending a few minutes each morning or if you struggle doing things in the morning, do it before you go to bed and ask God to help you the following day with making the right decisions. Um, but yeah, that is my, that would be what I'd suggest for you to do, to go away and spend some time with God, asking him to help you make the right decisions and seeing what happens with that. So yeah, so that's it for today. I hope that this will help you think about doing the right thing and um, just going to God in all of the situations you're going through. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, and in the next few days, I'm, there'll be another one and it'll be from a different member of the team this time. So yeah, so keep your eyes peeled and look out for the next instalment of Thought for the Day. See you later, guys. Bye.